so today I am doing a get ready with me Valentine's Day edition. I haven't done a get ready with me in forever and I asked you guys on Facebook if I should do it or not and you guys really seemed excited about it. So yeah, if you don't follow me on Facebook and that, you definitely should. My links are always down below. So my hair looks really crazy because I pinned it up last night while it was wet. So just excuse my crazy hair because when I'm done doing my makeup, I will take it down and hopefully it'll look really pretty. But this is going to be, I guess, a chit chat get ready with me. I kind of want to do a video where I do like just music in the background. It might be a little bit easier because let me tell you what, I take forever to get ready so I have to edit out a lot of stuff when I do a video like this one. I will list all the products down below. So definitely check that out if you're wondering what I'm using. And if you're wondering why I'm looking right here, I have my really big new mirror that I got. And it's just perfect. I finally have a nice mirror to do my makeup with. And I'm sorry, you guys, if the lighting isn't perfect. I try to use my lamp. I try to use natural lighting. Natural lighting really is the best. And I live in a tiny apartment, and the best lighting is in my bedroom. So I'm in my bedroom right now, but... I think right here is perfect because I still have the window light coming in. I don't know. I'm going to cover up that little booger there. Alright, I zoomed in the camera. <laughs> I know I look ridiculous. Oh, did you guys see my necklace? I got this recently. I'm trying to be more fancier. I'm just not into the super flashy colors. But I like this because it's like a chain. It's black. I think it's really nice and dressy. Just a nice simple piece of jewelry. I'm not that into jewelry. I don't know what it is. I'm just not that into jewelry. I'm going to use my Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 hour foundation and I love this stuff especially for a date night or if you're going out with your girlfriends this look would be fine for that too. So I'm just going to dot this all over my face. So what are you guys doing for Valentine's Day? I still don't know. My husband is planning something and he's not very good with planning. I love him to death, but he's not very good with planning. So I am hoping that he knows what he's doing. I have a f I'm worried. I'm worried that it's going to be a disaster. I told him, I said, you better make sure you make re reservations and all that stuff. So I'm leaving it up to him this year. He's the responsible one this year, so hopefully it turns out okay. So, I'm trying out a lot of different new products today. thought that'd be kind of fun, and that way you can see if I like it or not. If you guys want to see a really big collective haul, because I've been shopping and picking up things everywhere. It's pretty bad. I placed an order with Cherry Culture because they were having a clearance sale on a lot of different things. So, I ordered a lot of stuff, and I also went to Walmart with my mom and picked up some new Flower Beauty products. I'm going to do some first impression reviews. I got the new Physicians Formula CC Mascara. I want to do a first impression on that. I'm dying to open it. And I'm going to do a first impression on the foundation from Flower, the Drew Barrymore's line. I am dying to try out that foundation. I'm really bad. Last night I placed an order with e.l.f. They're having 50% off their entire, <laughs> their entire site. And I was really mad because, like, the the new face primers that I really wanted to try out and do, like, reviews and stuff for you guys, they were already sold out. But I did get my hands on the new Pressed Mineral Blushes. I'm so excited. I'm going to go ahead and just quickly do my brows. Alright, so I'm going to try this Milani face powder in light. It's the Multitasker face powder. I've tried loving this, but for some reason, I just, I don't know, it's, it's a really pretty powder, but I don't know, I'm going to give it another try. This doesn't give coverage at all, so this is just to like, set everything. It smells like baby powder, and not in a, it's not super strong, I guess, it's tolerable, but I'm not the biggest fan of baby powder on my face. Mmm. I guess since it's Valentine's Day, I'll do this pinky one, this Jordana 12 hour made last pencil. I love these. Oh my goodness. This one is in pink evermore. Very shimmery. Can you see that? Oh, that is pretty. This is the It 
Cosmetics Pretty Palette. I thought I would use this today. I know everyone's doing Valentine's Day tutorials using the Naked 3. And all these colors are matte. I don't know. I'm I'm trying to love this palette, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to really get into it. I'm going to use the brush that came with it. This is It Cosmetics brush. I'm going to take this bushy side. And I'm going to take the shade Warmth. And put that in the crease. Taking all heart on this pencil brush, I'm going to put this on the lower lash line. Just sort of like the outer corner. I'm going to take that same color, all heart. And I'm just going to work on the outer corner of the eye. Yeah, that's what we have so far. Now I'm going to go in with um, that same brush that we used. This is a really nice brush. I'm going to just very gently blend out the edges here. Alright, and now I'm going to go into Java, which is a really nice dark brown. I feel like brown is great. Instead of like using a purple or or whatever, I'm going to take on the other side of this it this it the it brush. And I'm going to uh what am I going to do? I'm going to add a little bit of this like right on the outer V here. I feel like even if you don't have a valentine Go out with your girlfriends. Go out, have fun. So this would be a really sexy, girly look to do. And since we're doing a lot of matte colors, I'm going to use this Transform Pearl Shade. And I'm just going to use that for a brow highlight. And put a little bit of that in the inner corner. It's really shimmery. And for the center of the lid, since I want to keep it kind of sparkly, I'm going to take this Prism palette from Elf. Oh, isn't it beautiful? I just love this palette so much. I'm going to take this pretty pinky shade. I'm just going to take my finger. And I'm just going to press that on the lid. I thought it was more pink, but it's kind of peachy. Alright, so for liquid liner, you all know I love my liquid liner. I'm going to try out this new Jordana liquid liner. It's called the Color Envy Waterproof Liquid Liner in Black Envy. And I've only used it a couple times and the lettering is already wearing off. I ordered this from my Cherry Culture order. But the brush on it is really hard to control. It's a thin brush, but it's very flimsy. But I do like that it sets really quickly. It sets to a super matte finish. It It is long lasting, but I feel like it starts flaking throughout the day and wearing off. And I don't like that. And it's not waterproof. So I'm going to line my waterline with this Physician Formula Liner. I love this set, by the way. It's called the Nude Eyes Set. And it comes with three different pencils. And they're just really nice. This one's like a really nice taupe color. So I'm going to use this taupe one. And it does come with a sharpener at the bottom as well, which is awesome. I think those are really handy. I'm going to use the taupe one on the lower lash line just to kind of add a little smokiness. And then I'm going to line the black one. Use, uh, use the black one to line my waterline. This is the Mineral Volumizing Mascara. I don't really like it, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to put on some false lashes. All the songs from um, Pocahontas. <laughs> I love Pocahontas stuck in my head. I just, whenever I'm cleaning my apartment, I walk around singing, you know, all the colors of the wind. Oh, maybe that's an embarrassing thing. I don't know. Alright, so I'm going to use this new concealer. A new product. This is the NYX HD concealer in like porcelain. And yeah, we're going to do some concealing. Wow, this stuff is pigmented. Whoa! That is a nice concealer. 
I'm gonna set that concealer really quickly and then we're gonna move on to the blush and bronzer I'm gonna use this little guy here I haven't used it in a while this is from elf um, they're cool bronzer I love this bronzer. I keep forgetting that I have it, and then when I use it, I'm like, uh, okay. <laughs> Why? Why haven't I been using you? Right, for highlighter, I'm trying out this new product from Flower. They just came out with these new highlighter sticks, and this is in the color Pearl Shimmer. And I am in love with this so far. So I'm going to just put this... along here kind of up here a little bit blend that in see look it gives you such a pretty glow I only got one just to try it out I might go back and get more yeah I really like this product and for blush I'm trying out this new blush today from Jordana this is also new this is in the color Rouge really pigmented blush but it looks really pretty on the skin though all right and I'm gonna try out these new eyelashes I bought um, from kiss I thought these would be really nice and natural they always come with these little tweezers these are awesome for applying okay lashes. guys so I went ahead and took my hair down and it is so curly I love doing my hair like this and just pulling it off to the side I do have a side cut so I usually just take like little bobby pins like pin it over to one side if you don't have a side cut you could always just take pieces of hair and pin it over to one side of your head and it'll still look really cute so this is the final look I went ahead and off camera I applied those lashes I talked uh, I showed you and they're just really I really really like them they're super um, soft and really natural they blend beautifully within my natural lashes so I love them and I apply my favorite lip combo currently oh my goodness holy girl status here um this is a flower lipstick in morning glory and I topped it off with this Tarte Maracuja lip gloss in New York Minute I'm gonna try so hard to find a dupe for this because it's the prettiest I have to show you really quickly it's the prettiest pinky purple and it's a cream finish and it's super shiny so I just Top that over top and it's the perfect combination. Set my makeup with the Model in a Bottle Makeup Setting Spray. I've been trying this out. This is new for me. Um, so far I do like it. The spray bottle is a little bit weird. It does have a perfume scent I'm not that thrilled about but it seems to mattify my face pretty this is well. it this is my final look valentine's day makeup look uh get ready with me i hope you guys enjoyed this video and hung in there because it was really long thank you guys so much for watching i hope you all have a great valentine's day go out with your girlfriends if you don't have a valentine do not stay home and pout go out and have fun all right so i love you guys thank you so much for watching if you're new to my channel subscribe if you're not subscribed it's completely free you won't miss out on new videos don't forget to follow me my links are down below and i will see you all in my next video remember smarter beauty is better beauty bye guys look who wanted to come and say hi it's buddy i want to come out and dance for everybody He's a good boy. Say bye. Say bye, everybody. Say bye, everybody. Bye.